Hey, what's up, guys? Just tumbling down the rabbit hole in Bitwig, discovering new things, and uh, I want to show you something really cool. So this is a minimal techno loop thing. All right, not that exciting. So let's make some effects happen. So what I'll do is I'll do that. All right, so I want to I want to modulate that, or not modulate that. I want to automate that. So what I can do is I can you know, drop this down, and then that works. That works okay. But there's an awesomer way. We can go to edit. Right when we have the clip selected, we can go edit, and then we'll have uh, the kind of warping section, because you can adjust your onset. You can warp back and forth, uh, and then you have your automation right below it. So we can, you know, wiggle this 8-bit frequency. That's cool. Let's bring it down. Right around there. Right, and I'll just use my pencil tool just so it's a little bit faster. You can draw these in, that's pretty cool. Right, I will select this all and I will bring it down. Let me turn jitter off. Let's loop this. Right, that's pretty cool. Now we can go and refine it, but let's add some reverb, big room. And I want to have this going on every second kind of effect here, or percussion hit. Right, and we'll do one more. I'll do a delay, and I want to change the beat repeat here. So the beat time. I'll change the beat time. Right, sounds kind of crazy, but we'll get to it. So let's, uh, so we have that. So let's go to our arrange view and we will be able to see our uh, automation for the reverb mix. So what we'll do is I'll drag this over and then we will realize that the automation does not carry over that loop. So that makes Kitten sad, but there's a way to fix that and it's really cool. So we'll go to each of these and I'll click on this little guy here. And this is like our editing. So I'll go free, lock, or loop, free, loop, free, loop. You can loop certain ones and other ones. So that'd be good for like sweeps, but you still keep the same automation in your loop. So each event kind of carries on its own loop. So I will loop this, and in theory, psh, the automation carries over. And that saves you from like having to double click, double click, double click, and then control paste, right? You have your automation there for basically everything. And we can see all of our guys moving here. Right, and this would be good for like uh, glitch hop, uh, like breakbeat kind of stuff, down tempo. You could do some really interesting things, especially if you if you get in there and you warp it around and adjust the like the pitch and the pan, and you know, mess around with the onsets and, and such. Uh, yeah, automation is pretty deep in Bitwig. I'm still trying to figure it out, but little tiny things like this really speeds up workflow. And yeah, I think. I think it's pretty positive you know of course you can refine it a bit more than me i'm kind of off and haphazard but you get the idea i uh, hope you learned stuff and have a good one